Today we're doing Lesson 24 from the workbook of A Course in Miracles. Lesson 24. I do not perceive my own best interests. I do not perceive my own best interests. <laughs> in no situation that arises do you realize the outcome that would make you happy. Therefore, you have no guide to appropriate action and no way of judging the result. What you do is determined by your perception of the situation, and that perception is wrong. <laughs> it is inevitable, then, that you will not serve your own best interests. Yet, they are your only goal in any situation which is correctly perceived. Otherwise, you will not recognize what they are. If you realize that you do not perceive your own best interests, you could be taught what they are. But in the presence of your conviction that you do know what they are, you cannot learn. The idea for today is a step toward opening your mind so that learning can begin. The exercises for today require much more honesty than you are accustomed to using. A few subjects, honestly and carefully considered, in each of the five practice periods, which should be undertaken today, will be more helpful than a more cursory examination of a large number. Two minutes are suggested for each of the mind-searching periods which the exercises involve. The practice periods should begin with repeating today's idea, followed by searching the mind with eyes closed for unresolved situations about which you are currently concerned. The emphasis should be on uncovering the outcome you want. You will quickly realize that you have a number of goals in mind as part of the desired outcome, and also that these goals are on different levels and often conflict. In applying the idea for today, name each situation that occurs to you, and then enumerate carefully as many goals as possible that you would like to be met in its resolution. The form of each application should be roughly as follows. In the situation involving fill in the blank, I would like fill in the blank to happen and fill in the blank to happen and so on. In the situation involving I would like to happen and to happen. Try to cover as many different ki kinds of outcomes as may honestly occur to you, even if some of them do not appear to be directly related to the situation or even to be inherent in it at all. If these exercises are done properly, you will quickly recognize that you are making a large number of demands of the situation which have nothing to do with it. You will also recognize that many of your goals are contradictory, that you have no unified outcome in mind, and that you must experience disappointment in connection with some of your goals, however the situation turns out. <laughs> After covering the list of as many hoped-for goals as possible, for each unresolved situation that crosses your mind, say to yourself, I do not perceive my own best interests in this situation, and go on to the next one. That's lesson 24. I do not perceive my own best interests. If you'd like to read my commentary on the workbook this year, just go to amytorresasim.com and click on Amy's blog.